Hi guys, welcome to this SolidWorks tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you how to add part numbers to Toolbox components. So to start off with at the top right I'm just going to open up Toolbox Configure via the task plane. And then we want to customize the hardware, so I'm just going to select that option. I've got my own custom toolbox which I'm going to select. And the part numbers which I want to add are from the bolts. So I'm just going to select this bolt as an example. So down the bottom, you slide across to the right hand side where all the metadata is contained. You can enter in your part number, description, and even a comment. So for this example on this video, I'm just going to do nut one to six. So whatever part number you got from your supplier, you could enter here to make ordering a lot easier or for the guys on the shop floor finding out which components are which. So I've entered my metadata, the part numbers, and I've hit save and I can close down the toolbox. So I want to create a new assembly and I want to go to my task plane on my right hand side, select my toolbox and I want to go into the bolts and I want to drag in one of the bolts we've just added the part numbers to and as you can see on the left hand side it's showing all the different part numbers available. So it's a really quick and easy way of selecting. So I'll add a, a few into the, the assembly, as you can see. And then up on the top from the command manager, I'll just produce a bill of materials. And there you go, item number and part number. So it's bringing it through. And I'll just change one of the configurations of one of the bolts. And you can see there, it's brought through the new part number, not three. Hope you found this uh, video useful.